Go. Tired of having to get up to give things to people? Now you don't have to with the new and improved catapult. This catapult is amazing and easy to use. We will be showing you how this catapult works, tell you how we made it and the changes we made, and tell you how this machine ties into the book. This catapult is very easy to use. You only have to follow a few steps. To start with, find the place that you want your object to land. Next, place your object on the widest part of the spoon, pull back on the spoon, and let go. When you let go of the spoon, your object should go to the place you designated. The first thing that we did was build a catapult was we built the base with the popsicle sticks and then we grabbed another popsicle stick and glued the tip to the base. On the other end, we made a little basket to put the object in. The second model, instead of a popsicle base, we used a wood block. The third model, we used a wood block to the base, glued the binder clip to the base, and then we wrapped the spoon in duct tape and placed the spoon in the rings of the binder clip. We then tested the catapult and we needed something more flexible to hold a spoon, so we used a rubber band in place of the duct tape. Acceleration. The faster the catapult goes forward, the farther the ball will go. Potential kinetic energy. Potential energy is when it is waiting to be sh shot, and kinetic is when it is flying. Power. Power is on the ball from the catapult. Um, when we were building our machine, we didn't have any idea how we were going to build it, just like William. In order to build it, we had to get the ideas in our head and like research it, just like William did. Um, we had to go find the materials to build it, and like we didn't get anything from our teacher, so we had to find it ourselves and like put it together by ourselves. And um, these are all the things that William had to do in order to build his thing. Now that we have explained how to use it, build it, and how it ties to the book, the boy who harnessed the wind, you will have to make your own 